Hi, I'm Mindy Weisberger with Live Science. We are here in very sunny Bryant Park in New York City. And if you look behind me, you can see a lot of people out on the grass enjoying the sun. But in just a few hours, they're going to be seeing something really, really spectacular. It only happens four times a year, and it's called Manhattan Henge. What is Manhattan Henge? Manhattan Henge was actually a term that was coined in about 2001 by astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson. And it describes a phenomenon that happens in New York City because of the special layout of the New York City grid. Twice during the summer, once before the summer solstice at the end of May and once after the summer solstice in the middle of July, if you look west towards the setting sun, right as it touches down to the horizon, it lines up exactly in the center of cross streets running from east to west. So everyone knows the sun sets in the west. But the sun doesn't set in exactly the same spot every day. And this is because the North and the South Pole are not straight up and down. Earth is actually tilted just a little bit, 23 and a half degrees. And what this means is that as the Earth rotates and as the Earth travels around the sun, what we see as the setting sun, which is actually the Earth turning away from the sun, it comes down to a slightly different point in the horizon every day. Now, on the days of Manhattan Henge, what that means is that the position of the sun is such that at the moment when it touches down the horizon, it's right at the center of all of these cross streets that are running from east to west. Now, the city streets don't line up exactly to true west. They're actually about 29 degrees off because the city planners had to design the layout of the city to match the shape of the island. So you're going to get the best view on some of the big avenues like 14th Street, 42nd Street, 59th Street, but on any of these streets that run from east to west, you are going to get the same spectacular view of the sun touching down on the horizon right in the center of the street. Of course, you're only going to see this if you have a clear day. If there's cloud cover, if you can't see the sun, you're not going to see the sunset. But if the sun is out, it's just a stunning thing to see because the sun is so close to the horizon, you get this beautiful golden light that reflects off the buildings and people are standing in the street and taking photos and shooting video. It's just absolutely gorgeous to look at. There are other cities where you can see an effect that's similar to this. Pretty much any city that has a grid where the streets are at a 90 degree angle is gonna have something like this. You can see something like this in Chicago. You can see something like this in Toronto. But there's really nothing quite like Manhattan Henge in New York City. And if you get a chance to see it, you really should come here and see it for yourself. I'm Mindy Weisberger for Live Science. Uh, oh, wait, wait, there it goes, there it goes. It's touching down and it looks fantastic. Wow, that's, that's amazing.